I just want justice. That's all. The grandmother of a Durham toddler is pleading with the community after her granddaughter, Minaria, was killed in a drive-by shooting on Cornwallis Road in late June. Just whoever did this, I just wish they come forward. They just, they took something from us that means dear to us. She was only two. She just had a birthday. Durham police have yet to publicly identify a suspect, but this video shows the car moments before the deadly shooting. Minaria's grandmother is devastated that the shooter still walks free. It's sad. Y'all living y'all life and she's gone. We can't see her, we can't hug her, we can't kiss her. We can't do any of those things no more. We are very angry because of what happened. It's an innocent child. We just wish you come forward. As her family mourns and pleads for justice, the community is coming together to offer support. We always say there's a Nothing that brings people together like motorcycles. Tanner Fisher helped lead a motorcycle ride to honor Minaria Saturday, hoping to also raise awareness for this problem in Durham. Just to end the violence, you know, it's, it's not fair. She lost her life due to the gun violence. Portions of the proceeds from every sale at Raging Bull Harley-Davidson, where the ride took place, will go to Duke Children's Hospital in Minaria's name. The event meant the world to Minaria's grandmother and her family. We're just grateful and thankful that the community is pulling together and just helping us out on this difficult time. In Durham, Sydney Schofield, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.